I'm Mark Engels. I'm the global product manager for wheeled excavators in the factory in Germany, in Kohl's. This is uh, the electrical version of the standard uh, EWR 150. Uh, in fact, as you can see, it's it's mostly the same the same parts. Uh, we've more did some modifications, some improvements. We stretch the two-piece boom longer. We can uh, we can reach a bit further. We can lift a bit more. Uh, all those features have, of course, while introducing that into the electrical version, we made it, of course, well adapted it to the new standards. We didn't want to go with a re reworked one, taking out an electrical, uh, taking out the diesel engine and putting an electrical motor in it. We completely reworked the machine. Uh, so this is the complete machine where you know that when you charge it overnight, we have tested it last week, uh, it works a complete a co a full day. Uh, and with a full day working, I mean uh, uh, traveling, I mean heavy digging, truck loading and even grading, which is of course light work, but uh, people do that with it. And of course, uh, depending on the work you do, if you start traveling with it uh, for, for, for hours, of course you will consume more, uh, more electricity than when you do something else. Uh, then when you start grading, eh, that's that's light light duty. That's the, the way, but it will last the whole day. That's the message. This machine for me, personally, I think it's for a customer who takes out the machine in the morning, repairs something in the city and returns in the evening. So it's like, uh, it's, it's an easy way of re recharging your machine. You don't need any, any boxes or whatever, or an energy at, at the job site, because in the evening you come back, there's a job to do, so like communities, or, or uh, those type of, of customers, which is ideal for these machines. The plan is to build the machine uh, from the summer of 2025, available at the first needed countries first, uh, and then available for everyone. Uh, and in 2026, it will be like any other machine, a full production machine, like anything else. The reason why it takes one year is that now the production line in Kohl's will be adapted to, to take and diesels and electrical at the same time. But as you can understand the difference in those two machines, it takes a lot of time to modify the, the fab fabrication line to take the ball at the same time. <laughs>